I've got the QF009 SU35 out here for the maiden flight. I think I'm going to sidearm it into the wind. Let's get out here. I've got my timer. I'm going to set my timer for six minutes. All right, I've got it in. Let me make sure I got it in the right mode here. Okay, so I've got it in 6D mode is what they call it, which I guess is like a 6G. All right, and I'm going to turn off the LEDs. That's not going to help me out here. All right, setting my timer. All right, launching. Oh, that was kind of, that was kind of weird. Wow, that is, that is in low rates, and that is very, very responsive. Wow, am I going to have to change my linkage? But, it looks like it's flying just as straight as an arrow when you got the sticks. Yeah, that is really twitchy. It looks like it's flying just as straight as an arrow when you're not inputting in, in the controls. Let me see where my throttle stick is. Let me bring it back through here. All right, I'm I'm at 50% throttle, just under 50% throttle. That's hands off. That's pretty good. The only thing that's moving it is the wind. So I'm throttling back even more. Throttling up a little bit in the turn because that is. That's a tight turn. <laughs> yeah, that's a very tight turn. And I think I've got it in a low rate. Let's see. Yeah, that I certainly don't need high rates on it right now until I adjust the linkage. But um, it seems pretty stable. It's just really twitchy for me. All right, let's see if we could do a low pass through here. That's a nice looking jet, but it's going to take some adjustment for me. Look at that. Holy cow, that's a good gyro, guys. That's a good gyro. <laughs> it, should have, it should have fallen out of the sky there when I got that slow. Okay, so let's see here. Look at that. High alpha. Do you see the high alpha on that? Okay, let's bring it back in here again. That's, I'm just, probably had about 25% throttle in it right there. Look at that gyro. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay, I'm going to gain some altitude. Yeah, that gyro is, is uh, really working hard to keep it in the air with as tight as I'm making those turns. Look at that. Look at that. It should just roll over on me. That's awesome. Okay, so let's gain some altitude. I'll put it into 3D mode. This is going to be interesting. Yeah, this is going to be interesting. Oh, I put it back into stabilized mode. All right, let's see here. All right, I've got it back into 3D mode again. All right, let's see. You guys probably can't even see it. It's got enough power to do aerobatics, guys, but I am really going to have to tone down the linkage. I just put it back in the stabilized mode. I was kind of losing it there. Okay. <laughs> I think it's going to be a really good flying jet. 
but for me I am really I am really going to have to tone it down look at that it automatically you know adjusts it, the gyro wants to keep it in the air so when you get too slow why well, it just automatically produces some high alpha to keep it in the air all right let's see it's so twitchy I don't know if I can that is pretty fast guys that is pretty fast all right throttles off throttles off <laughs> okay, okay I got throttle I've got throttle back in <laughs> they've got a really good gyro on it they got a really good gyro. Whoa, that was almost a touch and go. They've got a really good gyro on it, but the controls are just way too twitchy for me. But it's got enough power. Did you see that? I mean, it looked like it was going to come in for a landing on that pass a minute ago, and it was real close to the ground, and I just gassed it, and it took off. So it definitely, there we go again almost at a standstill there and I gas it and you, you, can, you can get yourself out of trouble it's got enough power it looks like to me it's got enough power that you're going to be able to get yourself out of trouble okay so there's my timer okay so let me see my wind is coming out of the from the water tower so let's come back around come back around and bring it in get it down get it slowed down here Slow down. Look at that. Oh, man, that is too cool. I want to do that again. All right, I just want to see if I can get a good landing out of it over here without it tipping over on me. Let's see. It's so rough. I don't even know if it's going to be possible, but... Oh my gosh, did you see that glide? Uh, the prop wasn't even spinning. I had the throttle pulled all the way back. <laughs> that, that is a great little gyro. All right, let's try this again. A little less altitude coming in on approach. Oh, that was better. Oh man, that was like a carrier landing. <laughs> this is gonna be this is gonna be a fun little jet. All I gotta do is, is tame it, you know? All I gotta do is tame it. And I think I think this is gonna be in. I think it's gonna be an awesome little jet. But um, I got some work to do and then once I get it set up and flying the way I want it to fly, I will give you guys that information. But man, that is very very cool that's got that's got an excellent gyro in it i got some adjustments to do on the elevator i've got some adjustments to do on the control surface movement in total so i will make those adjustments and bring it back out we'll put it in the air again and once i get it tamed i will be able to fly it around in 3d mode just fine i think and man that that gyro really really stabilizes this little jet guys so anyway thanks for watching and i will see you in the air